Hi there, everybody. Welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. I'm Pyro Dude. Here's a look at what I did with grinding. Terry's got the lucky egg right now. And I didn't do anything with Evan. This is going to be our team for our next gem. But the thing we need to do first is explore Eterna City. Er, it's okay, never mind. You look tough. I won't take. Um, I'll just let you keep your Pokemon. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> it feels great riding a bike with the wind in your face, doesn't it? No. Let's dig up some treasure. I'm from or Orberg. I work at the mining museum there. I got advice from the underground man on digging up treasure and spheres. Before I get digging, let me share his advice with you. While you're digging, you may uncover dark rocks. They're very hard. If you keep hitting them, the wall will collapse. Don't forget that, and you'll be digging up treasure in no time. I am... I am the first to have gone underground... Dug, you can call me the underground man. Everyone else does. I'll make a gift of this to you. You hold up your end of the deal and put it to good use. Explorer kit, which I won't need to use because I've already got a fossil. That's really the only reason to go down into the tunnels. I don't... I really... Yes. Oh my goodness. Okay. What do you got? Yeah. It's... I think, you know, if you play diamond, diamond or Pearl, that determines which fossil you get. But in Platinum, it's determined by the last number in your player ID. Which is kind of interesting way to do it. It's like even or odd determines which one you get. I want to go up first, but I'm going to... My friend said Team Galactic took his favorite Pokemon away. I don't think he's telling the truth. Team Galactic looks so cool. They don't look like common thugs. First of all, they don't look like... They don't look cool at all. And they're not just common thugs. I mean, they are common thugs. Hey, Pyro! You came to see the Pokemon statue, right? I'll take you there! Let me just spit everywhere. Can we get there faster? You move so fast all the other times. What the? So, this is Eterna's Pokemon statue. Shaping our world, our time and space in an intertwining spiral. Revered in Sinnoh are the Pokemon of time and space. Sinnoh's myth, its truth, needs investigation. Pardon me, stand aside. You could just walk around. There's room to walk around. There are people that actually do this, and it pisses me off. Oh, hey! When he smacked together, a brilliant flash of inspiration came to me. An easy way to become a great trainer. Yeah, that! Alright, listen close. Make certain all your attacks hit. Avoid enemy attacks for sure. Yeah, no duh. You do that, you'll never lose. You'd be an invincible trainer. Anyway, go check out the Pokemon statue. See, see you around. <laughs> Hi there, kid. They say this is an awesome Pokemon that people saw long ago. I say, lame. Uh, something tells me that there's an item. Hidden? No, no. What about over here? No. When I'm right, I look really cool. When I'm wrong, I look really dumb. Hey, hey, you there, kid. Stay away from that Pokemon statue. Team Galactic is conducting an official investigation here. Okay, well then I'm definitely going back to the statue. The plate was worn off. Or ripped off. Nope, no hidden item there, but I do want to check right here. Okay, fine. Eternal came to be long ago in honor of an ancient Pokemon. Though many things have changed, what is important it has not. I hope it remains that way forevermore. Jeez, what's the world coming to? Someone ripped up the descriptive plate from the Pokemon statue. Now no one can read the inscription. Why would somebody do that? Actually, want to know what it said? Yes. The first inscription went like this, sort of. Creation of Daya, giver of time. In laughter, there is tears. And likewise, the same time flows. The blessing of Daya. Yikes, I've forgotten big chunks of it. Including middle of, right in the middle of words. 
Yes. The second description went sort of like this. Birth of Pal, creator of parallel dimensions. Alive, yet not alive. Rifts in space. To arrive in the same universe, the blessings of Pal. I've heard some people talk about there once being a third inscription, but I'm kind of skeptical though. I mean, think about it. A third Pokemon alongside those that control time and space? Tch. I mean, there's never ever any sort of instance of there being three different types of really powerful Pokemon. That's just crazy. There couldn't possibly be a Pokemon that mighty. Have you seen the Pokemon statue? When I was a wee child, it used to be the centerpiece of many festivals. And now what is it? I'm afraid you've asked too many. Should I catch a Pokemon right now? Empty spot. Empty spot. Let's catch a Pokemon. Why not? I also need to check these empty spots. And I see a place where there's probably a ninja trainer. Drifloon! Well, that's interesting. Drifloon, the HP master. Right. Yikes! Okay, well, bye. Who wants a Drifloon, right? Those Pokemon are dumb. Mm. Now I'm sad. Run. I don't need you. Ah. Subat, doesn't that sound like a ninja bursting from cover? No. Schoolgirl Kim, haha. <laughs> you can be anything you want, and I need to stop laughing at things like that. Ah, I have been the spooked. I should have gotten you in two. But I suppose I'll set up a three. Oh. Weeping Bell, will I switch Pokemon? Keep battling. Just kidding, switch. <laughs> here we go, here we go, Mark 10. Gonna hit him with the gust, with the gust. With the gusto. Get blown away, 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 get blown away. Switch again. Alright, go Karen. Go Karen. It's your birthday. Not really. Kill him anyway. Hit him with that harden. Haha. <laughs> you. I am not afraid. Is that gonna r lower my attack even more? It's a good thing I'm gonna poison. All right, this thing, poison gas. I was doing the grinding off in between episodes. All right, it missed five times in a row. It's got 55 accuracy. It should hit a little bit better than every other time. Two times in a row. I have not lost a single bit of accuracy. Thank you. That's a 33% accuracy right there. Great, less attack. This is why I need poison. Yeah. 
Okay, I know who's getting the wide lens before I go into the gym. go. Critical hit. Good job, Karen. Except for the poison gas. No! Oh, don't mock me. Dang it, don't space bar fight. I've 87. Here we go. Easy. Oh, jeez. Aftermath doesn't really do a whole lot for me in a Nuzlocke, because it's only going to die once. I don't want to plan on it dying. <laughs> well, hello there. Oh, that device you have. Is it is a Pokédex? Wow, it brings back some memories. Pardon me, but what's your name? Oh, okay, hello, Pyro. I'll be sure to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. I've been studying Pokémon mythology lately, just out of curiosity. Hmm, here in Eternicity there's a statue of an ancient Pokémon. Have you seen it already? According to myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows, you may encounter something like it while you're traveling with your Pokédex. Oh, I know! Try using this, it should be more helpful. HMO1. Yeah, but I need a gym badge first. And it also means I need to bring back my HM slave, because Togetic cannot learn cut naturally. Take up somebody's move slot. Which probably means Togetek is going away, honestly. On the right side, I only have one normal type that's actually part of my active team, and now the overlap is water type, which is what I would rather have, honestly. Alright, let's explore south. I think I already talked to you. I did not go in this bike shop, however. Yo, give me a bike! You got a bike for me? I don't know. I don't know. I don't really care what's holding them up. Turner City's not anything like it was before. Way back in the day. Get it? I'm old. They say this is an old city. At least that man does. It doesn't look it though, not with all these tall buildings. Since that Team Galactic building went up, the city's atmosphere has gotten all creepy and tense. I don't know what those people are doing up in that place. We need to get them out. Should build a wall. Alright. Big mushroom. Thanks for the money. I feel like there's something else I could have sold. Mm-hmm. Ooh, yes. Don't need repels. Okay. And now I want to buy... How many of these do I have? Let's get up all the way up to five. How many of these do I have? Can I get all the way to eight? Yes, I. I mean, I'll have ten. I need eight. <laughs> Sweet. Now, are there any special Pokeballs that I would definitely want? Nah, not really. I still want to kind of build up money. All right, apartment building. What does the sign say? Eternal condominiums. Oh, not an apartment. Name rating services available. Nice. They don't really rate your names, it's just the move changer. Hello, hello, I am the official name rater. Want me to rate the nicknames of your Pokemon? Nah. They're all awesome. Don't you all say nothing. Excuse me, but you got the Pokemon named Buizel? 
I'm gonna trade it for my chateau. No. Hello, hi, I'm the building a superintendent. I'm a vigilant 24 hour watch. Okay, creepy. You could just be like on standby 24 seven, but like a at what? Eh. Gardena, our gym leader, goes out to Eternal Forest every so often. I always wonder what she does there. And then I stop wondering. The move recycle is to be used during battle. When you use recycle, Pokemon can use its item once again. I've had this TM recycle for such a long time now. It's not anything that I have much use for these days. I do hope you'll put it to good use, young trainer. Probably not. Here we go. In, in 1 through 4, I don't like using TMs until the end. Because, like, you commit to it and it's like... Um... Then Pokemon might die. It's just... I don't know. I'm picking the contest challenge. I'm not reading these. For some reason. You can't catch me. I set some traps. Haha, <laughs> I've got you now. I'm gonna take your flag. See if I could actually do multiplayer with other people. I totally would. But I never actually played this game with the multiplayer available. I got it kind of after that it existed. Because I played this game after X and Y came out. Yeah, I chose the right spot. Pyro found Bright Powder. Nice. Excellent. If you're visiting Eterna, you need to get yourself a bicycle and take a ride down the cycling road. I'll get that in a bit. Jeez. Going underground with the Explorer Kid is a blast, isn't it? I don't know. Is it? Empty house. That's not ominous. What's up? I'm ready to take you on. Hi, I'm Gardenia. I'm this town's gym leader. My last... I should actually give her a voice. My last challenger was this awfully speedy young guy. Actually, his name was Dud. He told me about you. He said that another challenger's on the way. So that made me antsy. At my gym, no one gets to battle with the gym leader, me, until the end. The challenge has to beat all the other gym trainers first. I'll be waiting for you in the back, trainer. Don't disappoint me. Oh. Don't you disappoint me. Alright. Oops. I did the thing. Item take. What do you, what do you have? Sticky barb. Oh. I'll go ahead and take that item too then. I didn't know that I could actually keep that when I... So give. What does Terry want, if anything? Quick powder. For ditto. Black belt. Oh, for fighting type moves. Muscle. Eh. Eh. No. 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 Wide lens is going to uh, Karen. No ground, no. Quick Claw's going to Porygon. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I should, hmm. Why then's a Toxic Orb? Yikes, probably Toxic Orb. Nothing for you. Give, so then who? Who would like the wide lens? Item give quick claw. Honestly, I don't actually needs the wide lens, so we'll do this. I actually have no idea what the abilities of some of my newer Pokemon are. Water type moves in a pinch, classic. The stench helps keep wild Pokemon away. It explains that, honestly. You know that one. Boosts the attack stat, but lowers accuracy. Oh. Well, let's give him the white lens, I guess. Wide lens. Give to Mary Beth. Alrighty. I think we're ready. You're not gonna do anything. So, without further ado, let's go. Let's go. All right, former Zoe. If that really is your true name, no, you're not actually supposed to have a grass type Pokemon. 
What's wrong with you? Hmm, okay. Definitely Martin, okay. Just had to consider a few other things. But I should resist her attacks and to be able to put the beat down. Now the question is Gust or Confusion? I think Gust, actually. Here we go. Blown away. Probably not, yeah. Roserade's too good. But I mind a Roserade, let me tell you what. Nice. Nice. Ice Fang, uh, yes! Forget a move. Uh, I'll scare it a Rage. Rage has too much risk, really, for it to be too useful. Because I have to get hit in order for it to become meaning. Clay Doll, will I switch my Pokemon? Yes. I will. I could use Ice Fang. I could use Bite. I could use Water Gun. Either one. Some hard Pokemon, but I've got a ca counters for them now. Um, Water Gun for the Stab. I think it has less power. Less base power, I should say. Well, let's hope Ice, Ice Fang does do more. Okay, that was a critical. Well, hmm. Come on, Terry. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, shoot. Go, Mary Beth. Don't get one shot. Seriously? A two for two? I'm dead if I hit myself. Let's heal. I am not happy. Two for two on the confusion with Psybeam. I think that's a less than 50% chance. Good stuff, Mary Beth. If you if you evolve into Octillery, it is game time. I should look at what level that happens at. The clock will turn now. The shim's floor clock, you can walk on its hands. That's how you get to the next trainer. Okay, while this clock moves, I'm gonna look up Remoraid's evolution level. Remoraid. That really takes a long time. I've had enough time to do this just about. Octillery at 25. Let's go. I am close. I should heal Terry. Could go back to the Pokemon Center, but I don't feel like taking a long time to do this. Hello? A button? Nothing up here? Okay. Fight me! She won't let me win easily. Well, yeah, it depends on the random Pokemon you were given, doesn't it? Yeah, well. I don't even know if I have anything. Um, nothing really. I mean, I got, 
I could use Togetic and, and Steel Wing. Um, let's just scratch it. If I'm faster, I might actually go for Bite, just for that flinch, yeah. Missed. Bonk. Yo! Okay. <laughs> Odds on confusion, everybody. Take your bets. The game was nice to me. Aww. Yeah, I should definitely use Bite over... If they're both going to be neutral, I should use Bite over Scratch always. I don't know why I was... Even though I don't even know why you scratched that first time. Cacnea, I'm going to need to switch. Switch. That should work. But this will work better. I might be able to one-shot this, although better free stats aren't great, so... Nice. Wants to learn Whirlwind? No. Uh, keep old moves. Definitely don't need Whirlwind. Give up on Whirlwind. Darkrai! I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna hope I can get it poisoned. Um. I, gotta, I better do poison gas before he puts me to sleep. I don't know if he's capable of doing that at level 16. Good. Oh, Toxic Corp doesn't heal Karen unless Karen's got poison heal. I'm a dumb. Right, let's harden once. to that once, unless it's got Levitate. Accuracy down. And now it's time to start pounding it. That's fine. I kind of figured. Nice. Scheme over whether or not that killed it, because poison would just finish it off. Nice. It'd be great if you learn to move besides pound. That'll do. Forget a move. It may also poison the target. So do I want to get rid of poison gas? I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of poison gas. May have been a mistake, but who knows? I think Sludge is also special and I want physical. I'm gonna look real quick. Once the clock takes 80 hours to move. <laughs> ah, that was much quicker that time. And then it, it take just about as long to... Oh, interesting. Okay. So let me just summary... Yeah, it's a special move. I, I, mm. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Alright, let's do this. And then I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center and heal before I face Gardenia. Lady Jessica. Elekid. What is this, the third Elekid I faced? 
Or is it two the second allocated and then I've also faced an Electabuzz? Or is it three Alakids and an Electabuzz? Or is it... Okay. Alright, Karen's got the ground move. Is it worth it though? We're about to find out. Haha, uh -huh. I'm especially defensive. I'll just tank that. Thank you. I'll tank that. Thank you. Yikes. Okay, well, let's see what Sledge is able to do. <laughs> nice. That makes me feel good about my choice. <laughs> Pound. Oh man. That sound effect. I love it. Alright, have an awful time. Yay! Just like your inability to conceal your abundant skill. The floor clock moves and time flows. There's only our gym leader left. Go on, don't be afraid. Did it look like I was afraid? I'm afraid of this clock taking nine years. And there. Huzzah. And the water's gotta move off. Gotta bump off. And then it's gotta take eight years to get up to me. And then I can go and heal for free. I'm not quite sure what's with the whole like southern thing going on with the music for Eterna. Don't really get it. Alright. Last thing in the episode. Hopefully, this isn't another long gym. Uh, beating episode. I think I could finish it in less than 45 minutes. I mean 40 minutes. And also 45 minutes. Alright, who do I want to send in? Let's go ahead and send in Karen. You kept me waiting. I'm Eternus Gym Leader, Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Come at me. 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 Swillow. Man, I wish I had Simba still. This gym is just laughing at me. Okay, let's hit with a hard end first. Mm. This would be where I wish I had poison gas. Because I would just... If I can get it poisoned, then all I'd have to do is wait it out. You know what I mean? This is going to be rough. Do you have another move? Come on. And I still hit you. Poison. Ah, oh, that would have been great. Well, nothing really else to do. Well, that's kind of scary. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Yikes. Please with the poison. I'm not the heal. I have to be aware of that of the critical hit with the focus energy. This is just... Also, if I had Pooh, he would have faint attack. I'd just be like, okay, faint attack. 
with that as soon as the first double team happened I would be able to go into poo but also dead I think I'm in I'm, I think I'm in dead zone but I can't just sit here super potioning all day come on yes okay Grumpig, I will switch, and I know exactly who I'm switching to. Honestly, I should up my challenge by not having me be able to switch in between, but... Nah, it's a default function of the game. Nom. Mmm. Tastes like psychedelic bacon. That was easy. Trico. Yay. Some good luck. It's not the end yet? I don't know. I'm pretty sure this is the end. berry? Ah, citrus berry. I don't know. I don't know if the next guess is gonna kill it. It's gonna be real close. I think it should. Yeah, okay. Well, that was super easy. Yeah. I am very, very good. I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? I guess that's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. Just punches me in the gut. Power received the Forest Badge from Gardenia. With the Forest Badge, your Pokemon can use the hidden move cut outside of battle. Now that you have two gym badges, all Pokemon you received in trades will both oh, oh, bah, 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 level 30. I've also got something else. It's a gift from me. Yeah, what is it? 86 contains the move Grass Knot. It's one of my favorite moves. The heavier the foe, the more damage this move will cause. There's really not that many heavy foes. I mean, there are a lot on the rock type spectrum and the ground type spectrum, so. Ooh, excuse me. A little burp. All right, let's get back to the Pokemon Center. No deaths in this gym. Let's go. I mean, Muck got a little scary there. That double team, man. Double team, sand attack, smoke screen. Ugh. Later in the game, those aren't as prevalent, but at least, especially at this stage, gosh. All right, well, anyway, this is the end of the episode. I'm gonna keep it under 40 minutes if I can keep this exit really short. So, uh, leave a comment, leave your favorite part, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.